it is time to light the fires and kick the tires here at the Port Royal Speedway and the Bob Weikert Memorial is green. Lance DeWeese leads the field into turn number one. Off of turn number two, he leads him, but here comes Corey Eliason with a big run down the backstretch. Eliason will follow Lance down through three and four. Lance right through the middle. Here comes Danny Dietrich. He'll duck down low with Corey Eliason. They're side by side momentarily off of turn four. Now here comes Anthony Macri working down low. Can he make the pass on Brent Marks off of four? Ooh, things got real close there. Marks hang on to the spot. Corey Eliason running in that second spot. Big thanks to Fulkins. Brothers trucking is a battle for third. Now second will pay 10 grand tonight because of that. Battle for third, picking up though. Here comes Dietrich going after Corey Eliason for second, and he's got Mike Wagner hot in tow. Mike Wagner has found something in the middle of this racetrack. He'll now duck right behind Dietrich. Dietrich, he's gonna move it to the runner-up spot off of turn number two. No, he leads the lane there for Corey Eliason. Eliason, he'll drive back by. And Macri shoots by Brent Marks. Move Anthony Macri into the fifth, or up in a spot. Now Marks comes back at him over in three and four. Great battles all over Port Royal from second. Oh, what a move by Danny Tietrich. Wow. They are dipping and diving here on the front stretch. Here comes Mike Wagner. Wagner looking to go two for one off a of turn number two. Can he do it? He'll pull right alongside the Wagner's livestock number 29, and he will make that pass. How about it? Mike Wagner looking good in this feature event. And there goes Elias and off the bottom trying to take the spot. Wagner has it. Look at Danny Dietrich on the move once again. Four car battle for second, third, and four. And with Lance DeWeese in lap traffic, these drivers are starting to close in on him ever so slightly. Mike Wagner in second, Dietrich in third, Elias in a fourth, and Devin Bourne in fifth. And here comes Macri up on the high side now, a five-car battle. He misses the high side just a little bit as Mike Wagner hangs on to the spot. Lance's lead cut about half a second that time. Elias in a border side by side for fourth. Now, here comes Anthony Macri. He shot out of a cannon there on the back straight away. He'll drive by Corey Elias for fifth. Anthony Macri is the man on the move, but Lance Deweese's lead nearly three seconds last time by now sits at just over three seconds. Lance pulling away in lap traffic as Anthony Macri rolls the bottom side by side for a moment with Devin Borden for four. Devin Borden has Danny Dietrich in his sights as Dietrich has Mike Wagner in his. They both go high. Borden taps to Gardner. There goes Concrete Kid right down low. Can't quite complete that pass as we just have 16 laps to go in this one. Zeb Wise trying to go two for one. Zeb Weiss picks up Brent Marks and Corey Eliason in one corner. Marks bangs or works the bottom. Wise bangs off the fence and loses the spot to Marks down the back stretch. What Good a battle. move by Devin Ford and a slide shot from hell to get by Danny Dietrich. Couldn't complete it. He tapped the guard roll for turn number four. Boy, battles all over. Port Royal Speedway once again. Steve Stively and gang giving us a heck of a track. Anthony Macri now looking to make the pass on Danny Dietrich. As this time by, we are halfway in night number two of the Bob Wiker Memorial. Side by side for the final podium spot. Anthony Macri goes after Danny Dietrich. Move back right to third. Dietrich stays high on the fence, and he's bringing Devin Borden with him. Things stay clear of the goose, and the battle. Oh, Macri tags the wall. Good. Down the back stretch. So Macri going to go after Mike Wagner for a second. He's got him into turn three. There goes Anthony Macri. He's into the runner-up spot. Wagner looking to go down low side by side as we are two by two here off of turn number four. Just five laps to go. Lance DeWeese looking to get Port Royal victory 122 and his third Bob Weikert Memorial. Macri wasn't able to gain there, but DeWeese wasn't able to add to his lead. Four laps to go. It was 2.69 seconds last time by. Macri doesn't appear to be closing in too much. 2.02 actually took six tenths of a second off. Lance DeWeese has lap traffic in front of him. But he has one lap car separating him from Anthony Macri. Lance Suisse goes underneath the Bobby Ray Hall scoreboard for the final time. A two-time Bob Weicker Memorial Champion. His third win of the season, career win 122, is worth 29 large at Port Royal. Anthony Macri second, Mike Wagner third.